Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day as usual. My day is fantastic because I am about to do an unboxing. Oh, I'm so excited about this piece. And if you guys checked out my recent Spend the Day With Me Black Friday shopping vlog, you guys got to see me try on a lot of handbags in that video. You might have an idea of one of the bags that I picked up. Now, you know there's a story for everything. You guys know I'm actually going to Vegas very soon. I'm actually leaving in about a week or so. I can't wait. My husband and I are going to celebrate his 40th, my 40th, our 15 year anniversary, our 16 year anniversary, all the trips that we wanted to celebrate that we weren't able to do so because of everything going on in the world. So I'm so excited about that trip. But to make a long story short, I have been saving my money, putting it aside, and I was going to treat myself to something out there. Now don't get me wrong, Never say never, I might have to still treat myself to a little something out there as well. However, this handbag popped up and it's one of those items that is really, really hard to get according to the sales associate. And it's something that would really fit my lifestyle. And I thought, you know what? I'm going to splurge. I have the money saved up. This is a bag that I want, so I'm going to do it. So without further ado, if you guys are new to my channel, make sure to hit that little subscribe button. And if you want to see what I picked up, from Louis Vuitton, then keep watching. Okay, so as I stated, I went shopping on Black Friday. I do have a Black Friday haul video coming for you, but I have two more items that I'm waiting that are coming in the mail before I do that video. I also do have a very special giveaway for you guys as well, so stay tuned for that video. But I wasn't planning on buying anything from Louis Vuitton, and I walked by and I saw this, and I saw that they had it, and I said, Hold the phone. I need to go in there. I need to try it on. Okay, so first I have the Louis Vuitton book that came with it. And I like to use these as coffee table books. I have the receipt here. Here is the beautiful packaging. Now he did not have the holiday packaging. He said he was supposed to get it in a couple of days, so I did miss out on that. So let me stop rambling, let's get into this. And when I open the bag, I will tell you a little bit about the bag as usual, and then I will also share some mod shots with you. But before I go on, like usual, I want you guys to put stop right now, First, hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel, and two, put a guess in the comment section of what you think this bag is, and then see if you're right. Okay, now let's get right into it. The item that I picked up, any guesses? You might be able to tell by the dust bag. I'm so excited, I haven't seen it since in the store, so this is a true unboxing. Put that right there. And the item that I picked up is very limited speedy bandolier in the M Prant leather. Oh, can we take a moment? So a lot of you were right when you, um, in my last vlog, um, I told you guys knew that I was going to be doing an unboxing and a lot of you guessed right. If you've been following my channel for a long time, you might recall that in my last vlog, not this one, right? The Black Friday one, but the one before that, I actually tried this bag on and I talked myself out of it. I was like, I don't need it, blah, 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 blah. But then I kept thinking about it. And when I went back to Louis Vuitton, I'm like, oh, there it is, they have it. I could not believe they still had it. Now sure enough, it wasn't the same one I looked at. The guy told me they did get another one in, but he did say that this is limited edition. These are very, very hard to get. I know that a lot of people have really wanted the monogram Speedy 20 as well, but I'm gonna get all into this bag and I'm gonna share with you why I opted for this bag. Now, if you did check out that video, you saw there were a lot of really cute, bags at Louis Vuitton. I tried on the Felici, which has kind of been on my radar because I like that it comes with extra little wallets inside. And then I tried on a couple other bags that were just beautiful. So definitely check out that video. But this one, I just couldn't resist. So it is the Speedy Bandolier 20 and it is so cute. And I'll tell you what sold me on this bag. So first, let's talk about the Emprunt leather. This is the monogram Emprunt leather, but it's embossed with the larger logo, so it looks really, really nice. You can see the bottom, it does not have any feet, but you can see it's got the slit right down the center. It has the beautiful gold hardware with the LV detailing right there. 
It has two zippers, but the reason I was really excited about this bag is if you're familiar with the Speedy and you're familiar with the Nano Speedy, the zipper just goes right across. So sometimes it can be a little cumbersome getting in and out of the bag. And the thing about the Speedy B is when you open the bag, the zipper zips off to the side so you can see it's a little easier to get in and out of. The mouth is just a little wider to open and that's one thing I was super excited about. So this is so beautiful. You guys know that I wear a lot of black. I actually have black on today. So this will definitely suit my lifestyle. I think it can be dressy. I think it can be casual. I already know that I'm going to love the Emprunt leather because you know I own the Pochette Matisse and that bag is one of my favorites. So. This bag actually made in the USA. It has the black microfiber lining and some people don't really like that a bag is made in the USA. They prefer if it's made in uh, France, but I'm okay with it as long as the quality of the bag is okay. And this bag so far so good. I did inspect it when I was at the store, but you can see on the interior, it does have the microfiber lining very beautiful i might have to consider getting an organizer for it but it does come with this little um, dust bag here it comes with the cute little lock it has lv on one side and it says louis vuitton paris and then it has the little keys so i can attach that to the bag there so it actually does lock and another thing it comes with as well, it comes with a removable strap, which you guys know I love removable straps and adjustable straps. So here's the strap right here. It has the black leather and then it has this beautiful gold and it's a really, really shiny gold and you can adjust it. So I will try it on to share, share with you how it looks. So first let me share with you really quickly the measurements of the bag in case you guys are interested. So this bag is 8.1 inches in length, 5.3 inches in height, and it's about 4.7 in width. It's really, really cute. I think the Speedy 20 is a perfect size. Now you guys know I do own the Nano Speedy and that is a little guy, but it fits quite a bit. I'm excited about this because I think it's going to be a really good everyday bag and be just the perfect size and again I love how it zips down so you can see the mouth kind of opens a little bit wider which I like so let me go ahead and attach this strap right here and I'll share with you guys some matchups now if you did follow that vlog I did try this bag on in that vlog but I want to share um, with you again I want to kind of adjust the strap so I can show you kind of how it fits on me Okay, so I am about five foot three, and right now I have the speedy. You can see how, where it hits me. I have it on the second hole, so you can see on the second hole, hits me right above my hip, and I kind of like that. At first, when I tried it on, I was like, oh, I think I might like it a little longer, but I like how I can kind of just rest my hand right here and then easily like access my things. But if I'm wearing a coat, I definitely think I would have to have it a little bit longer. Okay, so I have the bag right now it is on the longest strap so I have it here and even on the longest strap it still hits me maybe right above my hip but I really like this length so you can wear it like this as a crossbody bag you can obviously hold it you can wear it on the crook of your arm like so or just kind of hold it if you wear it as a shoulder you can kind of see where it hits me but it's so cute you guys really really cute the craftsmanship of this is just so incredibly beautiful you can see the embossed leather oh my gosh and then let me show you the inside again just the microfiber lining beautiful handles beautiful gold really really shiny okay so like usual I do plan on doing like a what's in my bag video that's what I typically do after I have it and then after I've had this for a while I will do a dedicated video but I just want to kind of share with you a couple things really quick first I want to kind of share with you how it compares to the nano speedy so here is the cute little nano speedy which I have done a ton of videos on this bag in case you're interested and you can see how it compares so this one is definitely larger. See how this one, when it opens, it can be a little cumbersome to get into 
but then this one it opens a lot wider because the zipper goes down so this one is going to be a lot easier see how wide the mouth is and then this one is kind of a little bit of more of like a pain but you can see how they compare right there but I wanted to kind of share with you what fits in here just really quickly so I grabbed some items that I usually carry right here I have my iPhone I have the iPhone XR and that fits in there nicely then I have my little Rosalie this is from the wild at heart collection that fits in there then I have my ooh, my Emprunt key pouch, which this is another one of my really, really favorite items. Fits in there. I have my Hermes Bastia because I'm one of the last people on earth that still carries change. And then I have another little YSL card holder. So all that in there, you can see how it fits. And there's still plenty of room. So not only is this bag gonna be cute, but I think it's gonna be really functional for day to day since it can fit a lot. And then it zips it up and voila so there is still room to spare so as i stated when i do do a dedicated video on this i will share with you some of the other items that can fit just from the looks of it it looks like the toiletry 15 can fit it looks like the mini pochette can fit as well but this is a good amount in here this is a really really perfect size so again i have the card holder my key pouch i have my rosalie i have my bastia I have my phone and you can see so like I said off the bat I think this is going to be a really really good bag I love the imprint leather the imprint leather on the pochette Matisse has been very durable it's held up really really nicely so I already knew ahead of time that the leather was going to be great so I'm so excited about this I really really am you guys, when I saw that it was available, I just couldn't pass it up. Now, the other bags I tried on, I thought a lot of those were really cute. They were really unique. But there's just something about this bag. I think I mentioned to you that one of my first Louis Vuitton purchases was the BD35. And one thing I always regretted was not getting this BDB with the strap. So I thought this was a good bag to add to my collection because it is the bandolier with the strap. It is the imprint leather, so I don't have to worry about like the Keta hand or anything like that this is just going to be a carefree fuss free bag it's going to go with my wardrobe it's going to fit quite a bit so i'm really excited about it so let me know down below what do you guys think i'm super super excited about this and like usual stay tuned because i do plan on doing follow-up videos what's in my bag videos you guys seem to really like those i can do comparison videos if you want me to compare this to any other bags and then i will of course do an update once i've had the bag for a while so i hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching if you guys are new to my channel make sure to hit that little subscribe button and i'd love to have you follow me on instagram as well and stay tuned you guys because i do have a black friday haul coming up as well and i do have a little something special for you guys so thank you guys so much for watching have a wonderful day and i'll see you in my next video hold up i am on my way i'm in motion let's go to the ocean yeah let's go outside we can hang out on the beach with our free